Okay. I'm from Women of Color in the Global Women's Strike. Okay. The mic. Like mothers in other working class communities and my immigrant moms are struggling to defend our families from austerity cars. Most of many of the current cars on communities all over the UK were first used against asylum seekers by both Tories and by New Labour. As asylum seekers, we were the first to be dispersed out of London, away from our communities. Told we were lying, demonized, accused of taking benefits and housing. Forced to survive on vouchers instead of benefits. Denied housing, health care, making us more vulnerable to violence and exploitation. Denied legal aid and access to the justice system. Like other working class communities, we face increased criminalization, trying to survive detention and deportation back to the violence we escaped from. We are accused of being terrorists if you are Muslim. We are blamed for every social ill whipping up hatred against us. Those of us who don't have status or papers are being divided from people of color born here or who have status. Now other com poor communities face similar attacks under the pretext of austerity. We are all being threatened with ethnic and social cleansing out of London through housing benefit caps and the bedroom tax. Camden wants to evict 761 families, more than 30% of Somali families. Across London, our communities are facing threats. Our loved ones are at the mercy of the racist police force killing with uh, impunity and covering up the corruption. Mark, Dug Sorry. Mark Duggan, Ian Tomlinson, John Charles de Menezes, Sean Rick, our kids are suffering. Sorry, our kids are serving endless jobs and search and being criminalized for crimes of poverty. 22nd of April will be the 20th anniversary of the murder of Stephen Lawrence. <laughs> <laughs> The 22nd of April will be the 20th anniversary of the murder of Stephen Lawrence. His family, like uh, the victims of Hillsborough, are still waiting for the truth and justice about the police com complicity to, to come out, but like them, will never give up and fight for the justice. As mothers and carers of society, we march and speak out as part of many grassroots movements rising up and exposing years of rape, theft and corruption in high places. We have a real and growing belief that we can come together, that in spelling out all the survival and justice work we do, defending families and, friend, and friends from, the, from this onslaught, we have much in common, that we can overcome the divisions amongst us and that we can build as the caring society we are all desperate for and need. No matter who we are, where we come from, Nature is gone. Long live society. Stop the push boys. Let's all stop the push boys. You can see they are actually making us fight one another. You, you wait and see until next year. It's going to be immigrants against the people who are born here because they are now trying to say the immigrants are the ones who are causing problems. They are not causing causing problems. We, we are actually part of the community. We ran from our countries for, for our reasons best known to ourselves. Yeah.